Hey YouTube, today we're going to learn how to move items from one TurboLister database to another. Now, you can move items between databases via a CSV file, and it doesn't have to be to the same exact user, user database. It can be to a completely different name, a secondary account, things of that nature. And generally that's what happens. So sometimes folks like to have two different accounts, maybe one is just for fixed price listings, one's for auction. They run auctions a couple times. If their items don't sell, then they want to move it to their fixed price account, things like that. So what you're going to do is you need to create a CSV file for this. So we're going to select the items that we want to move to the other file or to the other account. We're going to go to File, Export Selected Items. We want the TurboLister format CSV file. Select Export. We want to change it to the desktop location so we can find it again. We'll just give it a name of test. Now, something you want to keep in mind is the more in-depth your listings are, the more images you have, things of that nature, the longer it's going to take to create the CSV file. These items here are really basic, so that's why they uh, exported so quickly. Click Close. Now, to get them to your other account, you go up to File, if you've not yet created a new account, you're going to go new user file, create an entirely secondary account. There's actually a video on how to do that that you can watch. In this case, we already have created our secondary file and we just want to change users. So we're going to go to change user, brings up the manage user file box. I'm going to select the other account I want to import them to. I click open. I don't currently have any items in here. But now I need to import those items from the CSV. So we'll go to File, Import Items from File. We need to go to the desktop location since that's where we saved it. Click once with the left mouse key, select Open. We want to leave everything selected. Click Import. It wants to retrieve pre-filled information. Go ahead, say yes. When that's finished, click close. You'll see a new folder in here, imported from. It has all of our information that was just imported, all 12 items. You can double click to check them out. You can see all the information is still there. Something you want to keep in mind when exporting items as a CSV file is that the images don't always retain. Generally, if you don't remove the items from the original database, the images will populate over. But let's say that you, you know, had to start from scratch, basically, and you didn't have backup files, but you had CSVs, you're not going to have the images populate with that. You will have the information, like the meat and potatoes of the listing. You will have to reinsert the images if the original database is gone. And I hope that helps show you how easy it is to move items between accounts within TurboLister. Once you're ready to upload with a secondary account, you just go ahead and highlight the items you want, add to upload, and upload them to eBay. Keep watching for more videos on how to build your eBay arsenal.